Ladies and gentlemen, it is time now for the heavyweights. First to the glory ring, he grabbed the attention of the kickboxing world when he pushed Daniel Gita to a decision in the 16-man Grand Slam in Tokyo one year ago. Here comes Jonata Denise. Twenty-two-year-old Jonata Denise comes from Acura Chiba, Brazil, just like Saulo Cavallari, who we saw record a very impressive win earlier on this edition of the Glory Super Fight Series. Also a member of a Thai box. Currently ranked number 17 in, in his weight class here in Glory. was the 2010 Serbian Open Tournament champion who last appeared in glory for Tokyo. Please welcome Igor Jokovic. 28-year-old Igor Jokovic, known as the Istrian warrior. Istria was known to the ancient Romans as the land of bandits and fierce warriors. These days it is part of Croatia. Jokovic very proud of his Istrian roots, a one-time training partner of Croatian legend Mirko Kroka. So we are set for action in the heavyweight division between Croatia's Igor Jurkovic and Brazil's Jonathan Deniz. Well, Deniz got the 23 pound weight advantage, but Jurkovic has 53 fights compared to Deniz's 11 fights. The tale here is. Can Denise handle the experience of Yurkovich? Introducing first, standing up a right and fighting out of the black corner. This young kickboxer has a young professional record of seven wins and four losses. But four of those seven wins have come by knockout. Standing six feet four inches, 1.92 meters, and weighing in at fight time at 238 pounds, 108 kilos, here tonight representing Brazil, here is Jonata Denise. His opponent opposite the ring and fighting out of the white corner, a six-time Croatian national kickboxing and Muay Thai champion. His record, 47 wins with six losses, 29 big knockouts on that career record. At six feet, two inches tall, 1.88 meters, he weighed in at 215 pounds, 97.5 kilos, fighting tonight out of Croatia. Here is Igor, the Istrian warrior, Jurkovic. The third man in charge of the glory ring is Al Wickers. All right, fellas, let's have a good clean fight. Protect yourself at all times. Be my commands at all times. Fight clean, fight hard. Any questions, fellas? Hook them up, back up, let's rock and roll. Referee Al Wickers will oversee the proceedings for this heavyweight battle here on the Glory Super Fight Series. Denise coming off a loss to Rico Verhoeven at Glory 7 in Milan, Italy in April. Of course, Verhoeven went on to win the heavyweight tournament at Glory 11. Jurkovic has won back-to-back -back bouts outside of the Glory promotion, looking to keep his wave of momentum going here in his return. The bell in round one, scheduled for three three-minute rounds in the Glory heavyweight division. Igor Jurkovic. In the white gloves, Jonathan Denise in the black. And a quick start by Jorkovic. Body kick, counter, low kick by Denise. Mauro Ranallo along with Duke Rufus, Ron Cluck, and the rest of our glory crew here in New York's theater at Madison Square Garden, where the action is hot and heavy already in this heavyweight bout. Speak of hot and heavy, Jurkovic needs to jump on this young kid. Do what he's doing there. Punches and bunches. Oh, oh. he drops him with that check hook. Jurkovic goes down here. Early in round one. Five. Excellent check hook. Seven. Incredible counter. Eight. Good. Yeah. Right. Fight. And another left hook puts Jurkovic down immediately Three. for the second time. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. You good? If Jurkovic suffers another knockdown in this round, the fight will be over. 
again, a reminder, a total of four times in any bout stops the fight. So Yurkovich is really in a lot of trouble with Denise coming forward with the right hand and the right knee, overwhelming the Croatian. Now he needs to get his bearings back. He's doing a, a, a small tactical error. He's moving into the right hand of Denise, and that's what's giving him trouble. Just ain't another straight right hand. Now hemmed in the corner. Denise and Fuego here throwing everything at Jurkovic. Sticks another straight right hand and another right hand. Shelling up is Jurkovic in the corner. Left uppercut and a knee by Denise. And that right kick connects to the head. It'll be a moral victory for Jurkovic if he can escape round one, but he will not. The fight is over. Denise scores the first round TKO win. A very impressive outing for the Brazilian heavyweight Jonathan Denise, who improves to two and two in glory, moving to eight and four overall, and a very impressive uh, victory for his fifth win via form of knockout. As he receives congratulations from his corner, that's a Nikki Holtzkin, the son of uh, legendary Dutch trainer, now Glory executive Cor Hemmers. Did I say Nikki Holtzkin? I meant Nikki Hemmers. Yes, Nikki Holtzkin Nikki Hemmers. will see in Japan coming up on December 21st. Speak. One look, all three knockdowns. We're going to take a look at this again. Yurkovic was virtually right hand over the top, left hook. See how well he was getting punched at? He did a good job of dipping his head to the side and punching around and caught him on the chin. Here's the next look. Again, see how he, he scooped that hook right over the shoulder, came back with the right hand. That's precision punching. And the last look here, again, moving his head while he's punching. So as he moved the head, he didn't catch the Croatian's punch, and he came back with his own short right hand. Great punching skill. Denise landing a total of 17 power strikes en route to dropping Jurkovic three times here. In the opening round, Yurkovic was able to muster a total of six power strikes before being stopped. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout comes to an end. 159 seconds of that very first round. The winner by technical knockout, Jonata Denise. Jonathan Denise, an impressive a victory. Moving up to number 13 in the glory heavyweight rankings while Yurkovich drops to number 17. Semi Schilt, number one, but his future uncertain. But tonight it's all about Jonathan Denise. And look at these stats again. Great power punching, overwhelming, and 60% you know, of what he threw landed in the leg kicks 64 percent and a total 61 percent across the board great slugging percentage and again the power ratio there this arm shot 67 percent leg 43 and a total of 61 percent that's how you win fights and that's how you're going to stop people high percentages